What is good, Josh? I'm the Smooth Game Man, back with yet another reaction video, baby. And today, we are back with uh, Snow the Product. Back on the channel yet again. This is actually not her song. She's just a feature, though. This is Mercules featuring Tech Nine and Snow the Product Warfare. If you guys want to go ahead and check this one out, you guys said it was a good song, a lyrical song. Uh, I know Tech Nine is a lyr lyricist. I think so would be the best way to put that. Mercules, I can't remember what he's good at. Like, I, I, I feel like I've listened to a song of his before on the channel. I just can't remember if I liked it or what happened in that song. So we're going to be coming into that mindset fresh. And we already know what Snow the Product is going to bring to the table. Uh, top tier heat. So we're going to see how well all three match together if they can make a heat song. So if you guys are ready for that, man, leave a like, comment, and subscribe for your boy. Roll the podcast, keep pushing, keep grinding, keep sharing out with those friends and family, man, the enemies too. <laughs> Let them enjoy the content for a little bit before you go slow on the odds. No, I'm just playing. But, I mean, I guess it's, it's kind of fitting because it's song called Warfare. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going we gonna to slip and slide because it's summertime. You know what I'm saying? Shh, shh, shh. Slip and slide to the ops house. You know what I'm saying? And you just, just roll up on some water and leave with some more water. I eat they girls. <laughs> no, I'm just, I ain't gonna say this way no more. Yeah, we leave with they girls. Let's turn to this heat. Yeah. He look like a breaking back here. <laughs> when they show the top part, like just like from the eyebrows up, he look like a breaking bad character, low key. I feel like there's somebody that looked just like this came boo. I thought I had friends, but they all was wishing I'd fall off. Someone in my position, I was splitting. I'm like they all was with me, but I was killing them. Hate like I was competition. Vibes was different. People said they talked some shit, and other people said they never thought that I would listen. What the benefits was scared of giving props to women. Everybody pulling in a different direction with him. Vibes is iffy. Dang, hold on, hold on, Snow. Yeah, that must be the tech. I just was. I ain't heard you come into the song that fast uh, in so long. But but no, for real. Okay, she okay. So we see what type of bars we're on. Obviously, everything's gonna be fast paced. This thing, so we have to really turn up the bars so we catch everything that she's saying throughout here. But off rip, message is plain and simple. Friends sneak this in, hating on your success, and that happens a lot of times when you start to feel really glow up, glow up. You start to see who really was like they were supporting you because they didn't think you'd make it, and now that you made it, they're kind of a little jealous. If wish they did it, and there's gonna be something that actually happy for you. Me personally, I'm gonna I'm actually be happy for you. Of course, I'm a, I'm a competitive person. I always want to be better than you. So it might drive me to be better, but I'm going to still celebrate your success. I'm not going to hate on your success. It's going to make me grind hard. Everybody pulling in a different direction with him. Bob is iffy. Everyone around is shifty. I don't trust anybody that wasn't starving with me. Embarrass me in front of fans that you did not get with me. But y'all saw I profit off what I was hard to give me. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I, I, was, I noticed it at first. I wasn't going to say nothing during the first cut, but do it kind of sound like not exactly. Like It sounds like it's sampled. The forgot about Dre. Am I tripping? L listen to the background. Listen to the snares in the uh, in the bass in the background and that little like I guess like a guitar like club kind of thing going on. Listen to it and tell me it don't sound similar. Like like at least that was a sample. That was like the bass layer and they added more to it and changed up some stuff. But you can't tell me that's like not what it sounds like. It's a sample. Prevail on my fancy. Well, what I did for motherfuckers, devils in the details. It's just easy to me. You won't see me fail. Ain't no beating me. Bitch, you know me. Well, got numbers. I get apology emails. You see me leave. People be rebuild off fake me. Weed out. We'll repel you on PC. There we go. There we go. Flow switch at the end, too. I love it. I love the speed that she just switched up to on the end of that. That's how you carry a song. And then you were first one on the song, too. So you got to get that last impression. Give me a good hint for the rest of the songs as well. So now it's actually up to the other two, even though you the feature, to not mess up this track. Cause you set this tone perfect. What you gonna do? Eh? What you gonna do? Eh? What you gonna do? Eh? There's nowhere to hide. What you gonna do when your life's on the line? What you gonna do? Eh? What you gonna do? Eh? What you gonna do? Eh? There's nowhere to hide. Your life's on the line. What you gonna do? Eh? I like the hook. I like the hook. I got a positive here, so we can make sure we get as much verse as possible. You know the copyright be coming down here. Yeah, I like the hook. It's catchy, short, quick. Like I said, 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 it's catchy, short, quick. Like like it. Refuse to boot the fuel and arky tummy. Who could stop the suit tsunami? Fuck your YouTube views and your new Versace. This the Big Bang Theory and I'm Kutra Pali. I just flew the coupe and a blue Bugatti. What a huge new trunk that I use for bodies. Got a deuce to saw me. I'll shoot somebody if they tell me one more time that I'm Illuminati. I'm a Luminati. Hey, I'm, I'm sure that probably does get annoying. Like, when you really ain't a part of nothing shady or you really just be about your money, your business, that's it. You don't be doing no shady stuff. And the fact that this is automatically assumed that when you blow the, that type of stuff happens, I bet that does get pretty annoying. I don't know, you starting to silence people though that way. Mice, make you seem a little bit more suspicious, like you might be doing something. 
But I ain't on the other end of that. I was receiving of that deuce to me, so I ain't say it. Better the game should never question my greatness. I get better with ages while they never can say shit. I got leverage from Everest to Mesopotamia. And your style so huge, you can settle on cracks. I'm a different kind of breed. I'm a kid of any sleep. And the figure on the trigger with the clip and some of my jeans hit up. Then I'll pick up from the scene and the whip you've never seen. No prints, I'm clean. I'm clean. I just talked to some. Y'all hear that too? Or you just talked to snow? Okay, there we go. So I'm gonna rewind. But y'all hear that though? He said, Your flow is so over, you should just sell it on crazy. I ain't never been on crazy to buy something, but I feel like it's like, like really cheap, really easy to buy stuff, but also really easy to get scammed off of. But the fact that your flow has been so over, you said you can sell it on air? You ain't never signed us on uh, unique stuff on crazy, so that's crazy. Snow, they all will know it's smoke when the hospitals fill. I'm watching them get claustrophobic when they cough and close, but they gotta hold still. My enemies get shook when I'm entering any room, got this kind of venom and doom in my chest that I'm letting loose. It's raw. Head up, Jack, and I said, if you're in the mood, I'm ready to send it through. You better get in the booth. I'll never get it confused. I'm mentally gonna tune with the devil, and ever since he's been telling me what to do, it's raw. What you gonna do? I ain't listening to that voice. You got that. You got it, Mercules. <laughs> I'm not listening to that voice. I'm, I'm going to stay on the right, narrow path, moving straight forward. I'm just going to ignore the hate. And keep it moving. You on the other hand, you got time today. <laughs> let a phone bring cray. I'm a pick up a chopper, then let the whole thing spray. Then a soul mean hate. It's a low ding day. Should have never came up. I got in the flow king way. What I'm told, things. Yeah. May slow dreams. Hey, maybe he would have beat it, but didn't know Jing Gray. Another pro team. Yeah. Lay slow king pray. When I finish, I get away in the old sting ring. Mm. So that's, that's the part about about rap that makes it different than poetry. But poetry is just straight black and white. Like, it's got a rhyme, it's got to look like it's rhyme, but with rap, bro, you can add in so many things that don't on paper rhyme at all in the way that you say them, the way that you deliver them, the way that you can break up a word to make it kind of match or push two words together to make them match. It's what, it's what makes rap so, so, so poetic without even being close to poetry. Yeah. Homicidal, I ain't even gotta put it on, gotta run a Bible. Unless I wanna catch him and confess him among disciples, and lessen the vex and mess of oppression from his rival. They listen to Haji, and when they leader, respect him to follow, they turn around and try to stiff in your body, get in the kitchen to grind, and he spill a team, never sipping your tide, he spill a nigga like a sniff on wasabi. I know that hurts, yo. <laughs> and he said, I can't breathe. I know you can't. You just sniff some wasabi. I know that thing hot, nostrils burning, nose flakes burning. You probably ain't got no boogers left. Your, your sinuses are completely clear, your lungs are clear, everything is good to go. But you can't breathe because there's too much whole, uh, heat in there. <laughs> To even bring out them, them, uh, them hot flakes. But, uh, no, low key though, don't he look like the, um, what's that dude? Uh, the, uh, the Shadow Man from Persons in the Fog, bro. Like, with the face paint he got on, bro. When I got the hand, my everybody gonna do whatever God commands you. They created God to scam your father, damn you, making you the spot to land the propaganda. Yeah, yeah. I thought the world was to hurt me and deface him. Never knew that the spirit is Murphy and Z Nation. Taking all of religion and serving them cremation. Breaking away from believing I'm curving a Freemason. Put it together, taking Murphy and we racing. The people are thinking that we certainly free base and dope. What you gonna do, eh? What you gonna do, eh? What you gonna Hey, that's that's why our free will is a great thing. We can all choose to believe, follow whatever we wanna do, and uh and keep moving forward and still be successful, still live great lives, and you know, we just all gotta agree to disagree. And, uh, yeah. We just all gotta agree to disagree. <laughs> I don't think you're ready for warfare. I don't think you're ready for I like that. I like that. I'm gonna look, I'm gonna look how they be. I'm not even gonna, I'm not even gonna freestyle. Right there. Plus, that's a little bit too slow for my taste, so I don't think I would have added anything of sustenance to that. That would probably be pretty trash if I tried. But I, I gotta say, I think I like the I like the song for real. I don't think that anybody let up on their features. I think they all kept the same energy, perspective, and kind of like their own individual messages for what could start a warfare for them. Snow, fake friends, uh, Mercules, uh, Flow, uh, flow stealing and reusage, tech nine, religious beliefs. Uh, that's what I at least got from those three. Let me know down below if you guys caught something else. And uh, you know, you can always talk about well, you know, what other things that we respect or what other perspectives did you get? Because that's what makes music great. You can have 16 different perspectives of one song and it all be right. Because at the end of the day, you're gonna go ask the artist and be like, well, what did you think? <laughs> Look, there's like painters and stuff, but like, hey, what are you trying to draw here? Well, what do you see? <laughs> <laughs> like it's the it's the most common creator answer because it's like well what did you get out of it oh that's what i meant then yeah mm -hmm. that is exactly what i meant no and then it could be like completely left field i drew a donkey you see a giraffe and i'm like yes and i was trying to show how a donkey can really be a giraffe but it's just kind of stuck but even though it likes apples and trees the answer to the square root of five is the sky is blue yeah <laughs>
<laughs> like all, all some real stuff. That's literally how creative minds be. But let me know down below what you guys think of the song, right? Let me see if you guys got the same types of takes out of it that I did. I think those are all just like three different takes for what could start a warfare. And it's asking, you know, are you ready for that? Can you handle that? Can you, you know, uh, asking them ops? Like, could you go, are you guys ready for this warfare to go back and forth? If we had to, could you handle some of the warfare that's going on in your mind? What's the one biggest thing that would start a war between you and the people around you? It's one thing that you're tired of hearing or one thing that you are so passionate about that you know you're like on the complete end of the spectrum that you're ready to go to war for. Let it be known in the comment section and let me know other Snow the Product, Mercury, or Technology songs you guys want to hear. And we'll jump on over their Heat Fire and Caliente. So I'll catch you guys in the next video. Give me a shot this movie. Hey, Buckley, Target, Buckley, Target, Wheel. Catch you guys in the next one. I'm gone. Peace.